architect of their success was Gordon Ogilvie, a Daily Express reporter who'd been in Belfast covering the Troubles. Suspect Device, like many of their other songs, addressed politics and violence head-on. It was something few other bands of the time had the interest or the inclination to do. Politics was almost a dirty word to many of their contemporaries, and stiff little fingers found themselves under attack as a result, not least from the undertones who'd become by this time Good Vibration's most successful export. The situation in, in Belfast and in Northern Ireland in general had reached a stage where it was being ignored almost by the, the British media, you know. I mean, what had been sort of, you know, man killed in Belfast when it was front page news in one month, so two months later it had to be three or four men killed before it became front page news or else it was buried on page seven in a little paragraph down beside the weather, you know. And that sort of thing was, was very important to us to try and get across when we first, particularly when we first moved to England to play. It was like sort of, you know, like people are being killed over there and you don't seem to care, you know. And uh, so, yeah, I mean, we're, we were political in that sense, certainly. We've always said that all you can write about, if you're going to be truthful, is what's happening around you. And of course you could write, uh, oh, it's lovely bowling down the boulevards of LA on my motorbike. We're starting that in LA and I can't drive a bike. But uh, it made sense. And that it wasn't, people say, oh, you sensationalised the thing. But we didn't, we just didn't ignore it. Um, people are going to say that, oh, you did this and the whole Ulster situation. The first album has 13 tracks on it, of which I think five are to deal with that. But we used to, the undertones used to get at us in the paper and say, yeah, you're sensationalised this, that and the other. But we used to say the same thing. Uh, where are you from? You know, uh, this is going on and you can't just say, oh, everything's great and, you know, my perfect cousin plays the video. Maybe he does, but he has to be careful where he plays it. <laughs> 